Hey everybody, it's Abs Designs here, and today I'm going to be doing a text tutorial for you guys. Um, I'm going to be showing you guys how to add a nice reflection to your text, like so. I'm going to be showing you guys how to add a nice stroke outline to your text, and I'm also going to be showing you guys how to insert te uh, a picture into side of your text, which makes it look really good. Um, so let's get started here. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to go and grab a new document. I'm going to make mine the same size here as US paper. I'm going to press Control 0 just so I get a better view. So let's grab our text tool and the first one we're going to do is the um, the one where we hit our tech, a picture inside of our text. So I'm just going to write down Hawaii again just because I already have the picture for it and it looks really good. I'm actually just gonna, whoops. <clears throat> I actually don't like the size, I wanna make it a bit bigger for you guys so you guys can see it better. Um, it's really just, that's what I wanna do, um, you don't have to. Whoops, too many doubles. Okay, so now that I have that done, what I'm gonna do is I am going to simplify that layer. And then I'm going to grab my magic wand tool, and I'm going to make sure I have contiguous unchecked. And then I'm going to click on the black part of the Hawaii layer. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into Photoshop, I'm going to open up my layer, my picture, which for me I already have it open right here. And then what you're going to do is you're going to make sure you select this whole image by pressing Control A. Which as you can see here, as you look around the edges here, it selects the whole image. And then you're going to press Control C which copies it. Now you go back into your document that you're working in. You're going to go to edit, paste into selection, or you can press control shift, control shift V. So that's what I'm going to do, control shift V. There we go. It's in my text now. I'm going to grab my move tool and I'm just going to drag it out just a little outside my text. I'm going to try and keep every little bit of the picture as close as I can without making it look bad. So there, now I have it like that. Um, I'm going to go over here to the right side here and um, under my uh, layer styles I'm going to add a bevel to it and just to make it look a, a little nicer um, I'm going to add a simple emboss to it. So then as you guys can see now it looks really good here. Um, especially with that nice simple boss emboss I did, um, it makes it look really good. So, um, the next thing we're gonna do <coughs> is we're going to add is uh, no, I'm gonna teach you guys. Sorry, how to add a nice um, stroke outline to your text. So to do so, we're gonna grab our text tool again, write down what you would like to write down, and then we are going to. Um, we are going to simplify that layer, and then we're going to grab our magic wand tool, and we're going to make sure we have this here unchecked again, contiguous, and then we're just going to click on that layer, or that, um, text. Now we're going to go to edit, stroke, selection, um, make it whatever you want. You can make it bigger, you can make it smaller, um, I'm just going to leave it at 5 pixels, and then you can choose a green, you can make it a blue one. Um, it's all just what you guys want. Um, I'm going to choose a nice blue. And then as you can see there, it made a stroke outline. So I'm going to press Control D to deselect that. And then I'm also going to add a nice bevel to that one too, just to make it look nicer. I was like adding bevels and that it makes it look a lot nicer. So as you guys can see here, I added a nice stroke to my uh, text with the um, emboss and it looks really good. So the next thing I'm going to show you guys how to do is to add a nice looking reflection to your text. So the first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to grab your text tool and write down what you'd like once again. Um, preferably do it in black. Um, as you get more advanced uh, you'll learn how to do it in different colors than that. So um... Let's get started on this one. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to press Control J, which duplicates that layer. <clears throat> and then on the duplicated layer, 
you're going to right click and go to simplify layer so now that you simplified that layer you're just going to grab the top edge here and you're just going to drag it down try to keeping everything in proportion um, I want to drag it up just to double check like I can see that just a little small there okay so now I got my text like that um, so that doesn't really look that good it doesn't look anything like this one here um, <clears throat> so what we're gonna do on that simplified layer there you're gonna go in you're gonna grab your move tool and then you're going to go to transform uh, well image transform skew so what skew does is if when you click it just kinda brings it out like that as you guys can see there so I'm just gonna do that again just to make it and then I'm gonna grab the center one here and I'm just gonna drag it to the right a bit just then it looked like what um <coughs> excuse me so then what uh, a regular um, reflection would look like so we have that done there um, it's still not looking anything like this one we gotta add a gradient to it and a couple other things just to make it look better so we're gonna grab our magic wand tool and we are going to make sure we're on that layer and we're going to select the hello layer there the reflection layer and we are going to go to our gradient tool down here we're going to take some nice colors here um, actually I'm going to bring this just a bit more over here just like so and then you're going to click from the top here and you're just going to drag straight down holding shift which makes it straight um, it will only let you go 45 degrees 90 degrees or just straight up and down just going to drag it out and then select so that one it doesn't look that good I'm gonna have to touch it up a bit um, I'm actually gonna drag this just a bit over here more I'm um, gonna redo that so there, that looks a lot better um, it actually looks better than the one I originally did because um, it fades away more so it looks better I find um, so that's how you make a reflection an outer a stroke and how to put a picture into your text also um you can fool around with all these different things here to make your text look a lot better um if you want to add uh, drop shadows drop shadows are very useful um you can just add all these different things that make your text look really cool so i'd really recommend you guys uh fooling around um learning how to use everything on this little panel here under layer styles um it will really help you in the long run um Thank you for watching. Have a great day.